Hello, um, back already. Um, I figured since this is not really something, you know, I'm comfortable with yet, that it's probably best not to, um, go too long in between since I'm trying to conquer my fear and get myself esteem back up, um, and accept myself for who I am and my flaws and all. <laughs> um, but... Um, I just wanted to say, um, that I'm praying for a couple people, um, that are going through things. Um, I'm not going to mention any names or what, but I'm sending out my love and my prayers. Um, also a topic I wanted to talk about a little bit is, um, medical marijuana. Medical marijuana. Because I'm going to the dispensary in a little bit to get my medication. And... A lot of people have a stigma against it and they like to cast judgment on people who smoke and I just think um, we should talk about it more. Um, I was on Klodopin, what, since 2009. Um, I got off like, what, two years ago? Um, I've never had problems with addiction. I've never had problems with drugs as far as heavy drugs like cigarettes. Unfortunately, I've had my struggle with them. But, um, yeah, trying to get off the clodopin was hard. I, uh, actually been trying to get off of it on and off for a while. I don't really like pills at all. But when I uh, came off clodopin, it was bad. I couldn't sleep. Uh, my depression was crazy. Um, and that's where I think the fear behind the camera and all that crap started. So, what was it, June, I got my medical card. And I have been going to the dispensary and getting medical marijuana for my anxiety and PTSD. Um, it's been working pretty good. It's helped definitely with the depression and my anxiety. Um, I've tried different strains and that's what I want to get into. Um, the CBD properties and the THC and the potential it has to helping a lot of people, especially with the opioid epidemic. And even now with what we're finding out about benzoids, um, clodopin and Xanax and all those things, so I thought maybe I should share a little bit of my experiences with using marijuana as a form of medication and not recreationally. And maybe open up some dialogues about what people feel and what their concerns because I think there's a lot of miscommunication and a lot of misinformation when it comes out about marijuana. Um, if you guys have Netflix, please watch Weed the People. Weed the People? Yeah, Weed the People. It's um, eye-opening. Very eye-opening. So, anyway, I'm not going to be on here long. I'm waiting for my friend to get a hold of me. So, um, you guys have a wonderful day. And sending my love to everyone. And bye-bye. <laughs>